That's crazy. A look at whole innocent school building again with the mural graphic on it. This Holy Innocence Primary School here, which was the site of the Holy Innocence Girls School. This is where the girls school used to be. Before it all merged together. So this is Ashford Long Road that I am on. And this is open lot for sale over here. And this is the school building here with the mural graphic on it. Well, the Innocence Anglican Church, which was built in 1838 and dedicated in 1839. And it was built in the shape of a cross. And it was one of the Bishop Fallerage chapels of the East. As well. So the innocent Anglican Church. And this school building with the mural graphic on it. Again and again, this is the road to Harrison Cave and Watch Mahogany. And again, Harrison's Cave runs all underground here. All under here is Harrison's Cave. All under here is Harrison's Cave. So it is said that when service is going on at the church and the organ is playing, the organ vibrates into the cave. And that is where really the gas station at Rashmi Hall had to be closed down because of the pumps that are going into the cave. Fume from the pumps was going into the cave. So this mural, this mural graphic is a layer to addition to the school building. And as you can see that my rear aunt and other members take good care of the church. I have quite a few family members that attend this church, such as my rear aunt, one of my cousins and other distant relatives that attend this church. And again, this church will cover this church will cater to the spiritual needs of persons living in <laughs> Rachman Hall, Lyon Castle, Hortwell, Sturges, Chapman's Village, Carrington's Village, Highland, all in St. Thomas. And, it will, and, and the school will also cater to persons living in that neighborhood. And there's a road to the side of the church, to the right side of the church, but the cemetery, which is referred to as a line. It would take you back to the avenues and Rachman Hall. And the, I mean, it would take you back to Brian's Road and Rachman Hall. And would also lead you back to Harrison's Cave as well. So again, I'm in the center of the island in the parish of St. Thomas. St. Thomas can best be referred to as the heart of Barbados or the central uplands of Barbados. And there is no sea nor coastline in this parish. You can see over to St. George as well, which is the central parish. Over to the Groves area and Sweet Bottom and Sweet Vere area. Yeah, yeah. So yes guys, we should try we should try to first of all I would like to answer the you can visit my Harrison Scale, you can watch my Harrison Scale videos that I posted last Friday on YouTube and
there's a new zip line coming to Harrison's Cave coming the 16th of June which is a few weeks from now and it is now on and run by Chaka Limited from Jamaica Chaka Adventures and they are adding a new zip line to Harrison's Cave Eco Adventure Park Check out Tokwa Cave on the 60 on um, the 9th of July 2021. So there are no there are no um corners of Harrison Cave. And again St. Thomas and St. George has no seat in it. And again, where the school is was the board was a board and single school, Holy Innocent, and it was Holy Innocent's girls' school. The boys' school was further up, but the church cemetery. And the Vickers Club was also there. And the Vickers Club was also there as well. So, Paul Innocent School was also a refuge during Hurricane Janet. Hurricane Janet was a Hurricane Janet was a hurricane that struck Barbados in September of 1955, damaging many homes and taking many lives. So, Paul Innocent was a refuge that was going with the board and single school when it was here. And that was when it was the girls' school was here. A whole innocent was also yeah. Well innocent was also a composite school back in the day for children that didn't do well in the common entrance. When they leave school, when they set eleven plus and they didn't do well in the common entrance, they would continue their schooling here up to class seven and then they would get a school leaving certificate. Well, the Innocence Church and School situated at Ashford St. Thomas and this green building here is the church social center where the members can gather and have their social activities and the building next door and the structure next door is the belfry where the bell tower is situated.